What up family and welcome back to the channel. On today, we are going to be talking about mental health. Whew, this is a strong topic. So if you find yourself dealing with this, this, or this, then you are in the right place. So stay tuned because we get into it right now. All right? So thank you so much for coming back to the channel. I really, really appreciate you. Each and every one of you, I appreciate. And for all the newbies, welcome, welcome, welcome to the channel. And thank you so much for being here. And if you don't know who I am, my name is Ty The Natural, the self-acceptance vibe, okay? So if you need your vibe right, you need some high energy, then this is the place to be, okay? So let's get into this lesson, shall we? Okay, so as I said at the beginning of the video, we are talking about mental health. And the reason why we're talking about this is because pretty much 50% of people are going to experience some type of mental health. Now, I'm sure you're probably asking, what exactly is mental health? I'm gonna tell you. So mental health is the foundation of communication, the foundation of how we think, it's the foundation of our emotions, our learning, our resilience, and also our self-esteem. I'm sure you're probably asking yourselves, like what causes mental health, right? So believe it or not, what actually causes mental health issues is lack of self-acceptance. The whole point of my purpose, to get you to accept who you truly are flaws and all because we all got them. everybody so back to the lesson research shows that one in five people will experience mental health crazy right then there was a study that shows 19.86 percent of adults are experiencing mental health guess how much that is equivalent to i wait 50 million, that's right, 50 million people. That's a lot of people. Those numbers are ridiculous. That is a lot of people who are suffering from mental health. There has to be, there has to be some type of change. Like we have to get out of these issues. We have to get help. Um, we have to find our safe person who will listen to us, who will pour into us. You know, we need that. So with that being said, self-acceptance is the antidote to mental health. Now, let's talk about some of the effects that come with mental health. One of the first effects that you would deal with or we would deal with if we are experiencing mental health issues is stress. Stress is so easily um, to creep up on you and turn your world upside down. So find ways to relieve stress, such as working out. It's something I do every morning now, Monday through Friday. I don't work out on Saturdays or Sundays because I do give my body a break, but on Monday through Friday, I'm going to town with my workout, okay? And it's so important that you do that because it helps reduce stress, toxins, and stuff that will not release if you do not work out. Number two, are you feeling unfulfilled? That's another effect when you're experiencing mental health. You won't be fulfilled. So if you're finding yourself incomplete or not feeling like you're enough, then mental health is probably an issue you might be dealing with. Number three, do you find yourself having poor relationships? Do you have an issue with, with any or all of your relationships that you currently have? Because if you do, then you may be going through some mental health issues. Mental health will definitely uh, affect your relationships, either bad or good, depending on your mental health. Four, do you find yourself not believing in yourself? Do you have lack of belief? Do you stay at home? Do you stay in the bed because of lack of belief in yourself? 
that is a mental health issue as well. And lastly, number five, are you dealing with anxiety or maybe depression? Those are two factors that a lot of people experience when they're dealing with mental health. If you're feeling depressed, something that I used to feel all the time because I was in a relationship that didn't pour into me. It basically took away all my goodness, took away all my energy, took away my self-esteem, took away my self-worth, just took everything from me. And I was left with this low self-acceptance and this depression. So with that being said, I am going to be telling my story um, real soon. And I would love for you guys to stay tuned for that because it's really going to give you more insight of who I am and why this, this topic really resonates with my soul and why I'm so passionate about women's empowerment. Because this all stems from women empowerment. Now, this information is for anyone. It's not just for women. But my niche is technically women empowerment, specifically dealing with self-acceptance. I want you to know that giving yourself grace and accepting all your flaws is the first step to improving your mental health. I want to share this last fact with you. In 2017, there was a study that shows 792 million people in the world is experiencing mental health issues. So please, please do not stay stagnant in your issues. Seek help. Seek help. Find your safe person. I'm definitely willing to be your safe person. I am creating a powerful and safe community just for my women who suffer from mental health issues and self-acceptance issues. So if you would like to be a part of that, definitely send me a comment and we can go from there. Um, but other than that, that is all I have for you guys. I really, really hope that you enjoyed this content. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. It will definitely show the algorithm that you are that you are enjoying this content and it helps out your girl's channel. And if you have not already, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Join the family and let's keep growing this community. We are trying to get to 800 next, then 900 and then to our thousand. So let's support each other. Let's love on each other. And most importantly, go love on you because before anybody else is worthy of your love, you are worthy of your love. I. So I'm Tide Natural. That's all I got for you guys today. I love y'all. Thank you for watching. And I'm going to see y'all back on the next video. Bye. Peace.